North Korea's leader Kim Jong-un showed Russia's defense minister the country's banned ballistic missiles at a defense exhibition as the neighbors pledged to boost ties. That's according to North Korean state media on Thursday. The Russian minister Sergei Shoigu and a Chinese delegation led by a Communist Party Politburo member arrived in North Korea this week. They're visiting for the 70th anniversary of the end of the Korean War, celebrated in North Korea as Victory Day. The nuclear-capable missiles were banned under UN Security Council resolutions adopted with Russian and Chinese support, but they provided a striking backdrop for a show of solidarity by three countries united by their rivalry with the US. Shoigu is making the first visit by a Russian defense minister to North Korea since the fall of the Soviet Union. For North Korea, the arrival of the delegations marks its first major opening up to the world since the COVID-19 pandemic. North Korean media reported that Shoigu gave Kim a letter from Russian President Vladimir Putin. Kim said the visit had deepened what he called the strategic and traditional relations between North Korea and Russia. North Korean media said Kim expressed the belief that, quote, the Russian army and people would achieve big successes in the struggle for building a powerful country. Local media reports on KCNA did not refer to the war in Ukraine. But North Korea's defense minister, Kang Sun Nam, was reported as saying North Korea fully supported what he called Russia's battle for justice and to protect its sovereignty. North Korean media said Kim also met Chinese Communist Party Politburo member Li Hongzhong for talks and was handed a letter from Chinese President Xi Jinping.